Hello children, I'm your teacher Lizelle. Today we are going to discuss the different kinds of verbs. It is important to learn the kinds of verbs because they are one of the main parts of a sentence. Before we proceed to our discussion, let's have first our objectives. At the end of the lesson, the students should be able to A. Identify the kinds of verbs B. Construct a sentence using the action verbs, the linking verbs, and helping verbs C. Appreciate the importance of using the three kinds of verbs in our daily life but before anything else, I want you to know my classroom rules. I prepared three classroom rules. So first, I have here, uh, let's start the day by a time every time. Let's come earlier in school. Let's be punctual. Number two, always listen when someone is speaking. If I discuss here in front of you, just listen carefully because at the end of the lesson, I have a questions and activity. Number three, raise your hand if you have a question. Don't answer me in chorus. Am I clear, class? Alright. Now, let's proceed to our discussion. This morning, our topic is all about the kinds of verbs. There are three kinds of verbs, the linking verbs, helping verbs, and the action verbs. Now, let's identify first what is a verb. A verb is a word that expresses an action or state of being. A sentence may either have a main verb, a helping verb, or both. In other words, a verb is a word that informs about an action, an existence of something or occurrence. The verb is the main word in a sentence. No sentence can be completed without a verb. What is linking verb? It links or connects the subject with a noun or adjective in the predicate that names or describes the subject. Let us evaluate the following sentences. First example here is the flower are bright. The second example here is my father is an engineer. And the sentence number one, the subject is flower. The verb is are, which is our linking verb. And it's connect the adjectives bright. And sentence number two, the subject is father. The verb is, which is our linking verb. And it's connect the word engineer, which is a noun. These are the most common linking verbs. The word am, is, are, was, and where. Belong to the verb to be we use am or was with a pronoun I. We use is or was when the subject of the sentence is singular. We use are or where when the subject is plural. Other linking verbs or being verbs Taste, feel, look, smell, appear, grow, prove, remain, sound, and stay Now let's proceed the other kinds of verbs What is helping verbs? It comes before the main verb and a sentence to form a complete verb These are the following examples of helping verbs they are going to the conference in May. Number two, Jane is moving to a new house. Number three, Laurie will drive to Dora tomorrow. And sentence number one, are is the helping verb because it helps the main verb going. And number two, is is the helping verb because it helps the main verb moving. And number three, well is the helping verb because it helps the, the main verb drive. Now, let's proceed the last kinds of verb. What is action verb? It expresses a specific action and is used any time you want to show action or discuss someone doing something. Now, let's proceed the example of action verb. Run Dance Eight 
drink run dance eat and drink let's have another examples of action words sing cry handshake talk sing cry handshake and talk this is the following examples of helping words fight clap hug bath fight clap hug and bath sleep right think cut sleep right think and cut another examples of action word and left in a hurry he visited his friend for a while. In the first sentence, Anne will be the subject, left is our action verbs. In the second sentence, he is our subject, visited is our action verb. The following examples of action verb, jump, through, bell, run, walk, eat, ride, play, give some verbs can function as either linking verbs or action verbs for example my aunt smells the food she looked for fresh flowers and the other side is the linking verb the food smells bad the flower looked fresh a quick and easy test is to replace the verb you suspect in the sentence with an appropriate form of a true linking verb. If the sentence still makes sense, it is a linking verb. If it is not logical with the substitutions, it is an action verb. Now, for this time, we all done our discussion. Before we proceed to our group activity, let's check off or review first our lesson for this morning. Since we already done our discussion, I have here a question. Now, in this morning, what is our lesson that we tackled today? If you have your answer and question, don't forget our classroom rules. Number 3. Raise your hand if you have your answer or question. Yes, Babia. Alright, very good. Our topic for this morning is all about the kinds of verb. Now, who can give me the three kinds of verb? Yes, Jane Rose. Okay, very good. The three kinds of verb is the linking verb, action verb, and the helping verb. Now, it's time to our group activity. Don't worry class because group 1 and group 2 will be differentiated tests. For group 1, construct the kinds of verbs. And for the group 2, underline the kinds of verbs and identify the kinds of verbs that constructs of group 1. Am I clear class? Alright. I will give 5 minutes to do the test. The timer starts now.
Now, pass your paper. Congratulations! So, I hope you learned something for today. Thank you and God bless.